Greetings all, Devious Monkey here. Right off the bat, gonna have to apologize. There are workers outside. I don't know what the hell they're doing, but since I decided to film, they're beating the hell out of some kind of metal thing. That's all I can hear. But they could be doing that for hours, so I don't, you know, I have to film. Okay, so the past couple of days, I've felt like utter shit. Um, I'm having tract issues, and I've probably lost 10 pounds. Because of that, I have been completely unmotivated to do anything other than lay there whimpering. Uh, yesterday was the, the day after the aftermath of the hurricane that hit here, or, you know, that rolled through. Right here in my place, we didn't really experience too much other than super heavy rain, heavy winds, and a tornado. Tornado didn't come near us, actually, but it was in the Virginia Beach area. So we didn't really have any problems, but there are a lot of places that are without power. Now, fortunately, because I live right on the same grid as the major hospital area, losing power isn't usually a big deal because we're on the same circuit and that hospital gets priority. So anytime we lose power, it almost immediately comes back on. And we've never lost power for, for any great serious length of time. And this time, I don't think we lost it at all. Today, I was hoping that I would feel better. I don't even really know what, what happened. Uh, I know I've been pretty miserable. I went to the chiropractor. I didn't have a good adjustment because everything was really tight in my neck. So I had a really wicked headache and, and then all the other issues just started coming up. So I went through that yesterday and I, I was hoping today I would wake up and, I, and you know that I, I would just be better. So I got up this morning, went for a walk because I didn't do shit yesterday. I mean, I didn't think it was that hot but I'm still not well, so it hit me a lot harder than it, than it normally would. And I walked in the door and my wife was like, Jesus, you look like you just like rose out of the tub. You need to sit down and cool down. I immediately was like, I thought I was gonna pass out. So I came upstairs and I sat here, you know, with the AC on and the, and the fan going, eventually cooled down enough and I was drinking water that I felt okay, but I still haven't felt right today. Not as bad as yesterday, but still not right. And that kind of leads me to what I wanted to talk about was creating when you just don't want to for one reason or another. Now, it, it could be burnout. It could just be that you don't have any ideas. Or in my case, a lot of times, the gist of this channel, trying to create when you have a body that just doesn't want to cooperate. Again, I was miserable yesterday, not as miserable today, although I still haven't been able to get rid of this headache. So I have been completely unmotivated to do anything. Now, on top of all that, you know how I was talking about how I put that AC in here and, and it brought blessed relief during this heat wave that we're in now, uh, that it's so hot in here from all the equipment. And I said, you know, I'm, we'll see how long it lasts before, you know, some idiot turns me in and, and they tell me I have to take it down. Uh, what was it, a week? And the president of the condo association was walking around noting storm damage and basically just started chastising me through my window for for daring to have this AC unit in my window. I do not care to expend the energy arguing with this ridiculous board and their fucking stupid rules. So I pulled it. Today I, I felt good enough. I pulled the AC. It's down in the in the garage draining so that I can return it. And it's hot as balls in here. You know, I mean these stupid rules just bewilders me, but I'm not gonna go off on that tangent because I could sit here and, and be mad as a wet hen and, and frothing about how pissed off I am about the whole stupid thing. I am looking into portable AC units, also not a great solution, but at least I can have it because it doesn't break their stupid rule as it's written. The only problem is that it, it it's almost twice as expensive and I, I'm actually feeling like I do not wanna spend the money and I'll just have to suck it up and deal with the fact that it's fucking hot in here. At least I got a week of, of, you know, actually feeling good. All this is culminates, this is what I'm talking about, of having to deal with stress and, and trying to create when you don't have a body that cooperates with you. Uh, I have felt like shit, I'm roasting ass hot, I, I'm hungry, I wanna eat, but I don't wanna eat because I don't wanna deal with the repercussions of what's been happening when I eat the past couple of days. That has left me completely devoid of any motivation to shoot video or to take a picture at all. Yesterday, it was there was no question in my mind that, that I was not gonna create a video 
or pick up a camera and take a picture or any of that shit. So I just was like, yeah, I'm just not putting a video up. And then today I actually shot probably two videos while I was walking and decided that I didn't feel like posting that stuff either. And I've been sitting here doing work and I've been researching portable air conditioning units and I've been paying bills and doing financial shit and just, I've been doing all kinds of stuff today as much as I can feeling the way that I do whilst being hot, sweaty, and pissed off. But I, I don't want to get out of the habit of shooting. And, and again, I've gotten to the point where I actually don't feel right if I don't post a video in a day. Now, yesterday, my health trumped all that stuff. I, I didn't give a shit. I wasn't posting a video. But today, I knew I had to shoot something. So I wanted to talk about the fact that, that here we go. Here's the challenges of having a body that doesn't want to cooperate. And I needed to shoot, but I just felt like shit. And I didn't want to. And, you know, but I'm forcing myself through it. Sometimes that's what you have to do. You have to force through your pain. You have to force yourself through your discomfort to keep going, then to keep a good habit going. But there is a point where you have to realize that you're not doing yourselves any favors by forcing yourself to go out and create at the expense of your health. And that includes mental health as well. I know I, I'm, I always tell you, I, I beat myself up. I'm, I'm my own worst critic had that internal dialogue today of like, fucking loser, like you're not that bad, get the hell up and make a video, uh, think of something. And, and I was just like, you know, fuck you. Like I don't feel well, I don't feel like it. Ultimately, we see which one won out and, and I decided that I am well enough to, to create something and I, I was just being lazy. Granted, I still don't feel well, but it really was more being lazy and I was just like, yeah, I just don't feel like doing it. So here I am. Now, the other thing is, is that there's my light system. Uh, so this is, this is that Godox stuff that I, that I bought for the flash that I've determined will work with my, with my Sony stuff. And it's basically, and I don't want to take it apart cause I'm not going to set it up yet and I don't want it laying around. So it's basically a soft box and another grid system for the soft box and the housing unit to be able to slide a flash into it and use it that way. I basically have a portable portable softbox lighting strobe system for taking pictures because I wanna start shooting again like that and I realized that I needed to have some kind of strobe system. So I did pick this up today. I did order another light stand for it, but unfortunately that's not gonna be here until this weekend. So after this weekend, I'll set this all, or actually this weekend, probably, I think I'm supposed to get the, the lights down Saturday. I will set all this stuff up and, you know, I'll show you the finished product and, and take some pictures and show you all the, how that shit is. That was really all I wanted to talk about. I just wanted to whine about how shitty I felt and, and that's why I didn't post a video yesterday uh, and why you barely got a video today. That's all I wanted to talk about today. As always, thanks for joining me. Like, subscribe, and all that shit you know, because I know you want to hear about my track all the time. And how can you miss out? Well, you miss out by not subscribing. So like, subscribe, and all that shit. And remember, kids, forward and up.